Nate Landman. It's just such a bummer, dude. It's so hard in the wake of these injuries to transfer the excitement we had for the, yeah. you know, 10 RAS freak of nature athlete Troy Anderson on to Nate freaking Landman. I don't know, dude. It's hard. Uh, but you're right. If he does get the full time role, that could be a, a nice little waiver wire ad there. That's all we're hoping for is we're hoping for that full time role because that it itself will create production. If he can be efficient uh, on a weekly basis, that's great. This is why we don't want to spend a, a ton of draft capital on linebackers in fantasy drafts every single year because every single year there are the Nate Landmans of the world that we can pick up off waiver wires. That is a uh, Avengers reject if I've ever heard one. That's like the aquatic characters like human alter ego, right? I am not yeah. Ocean Man. I'm Nate Landman. I don't do anything in the ocean. So yeah, when you've got Marvel reject heroes as your waiver wire ads, we're at a dark place already.